drivers and train drivers and all of that. We need some good people. We need people that want to work. Hey guys, welcome back to Lana's Closet. Okay, so back with another video. And as you can see, I'm in my room, chilling. Just came home not too long ago, like an hour ago, whatever. And I just felt like I want to do a little girls, girls chat. I just want to talk, get my point across, get my views going, get my opinions across. Because, like, I don't really be talking to a lot of people these days since I got home, since I graduated. I just kind of be staying to myself. I be talking to who talk to me. I be giving effort into people who give effort into me. So, yeah. Um, I kind of really wanted to base this video on influence because I feel like influence will always be there and it's a very scary thing and a lot of people don't realize it, but a lot, everybody in this whole world is influenced. I am an influencer. Y'all are all probably influenced by me in which that could be a good thing or a bad thing in whether y'all take me as a good influencer or a bad influencer. It's everybody's opinion. Everybody got their own opinion. But basically, I just wanted to talk about influence. Um, I think it's very important we, to we touch based on who we should be influenced by and who we shouldn't. I think this day and age, 2022, has taught me a hella a lot. And um, I'm, I feel like I'm a changed person, not gonna lie. I feel like I've changed. I feel like I've grown. I feel like I've matured. No matter who thinks otherwise, I know who I am. I'm an Aries. No one's going to change how I feel. I'm high-headed. I don't care. But anyways, we're going to touch base on influence because a lot of people are influenced and not in a good way either. Um, I'm going to need to touch base on the influence in middle school and high school real quickly because that is where you easily provoked and easily influence to do things that you know you nor normally wouldn't do but since you see a friend or since you see somebody that's cool that's doing it you want to follow it too um people people pretend to be somebody they're not just because they think it's cool and everybody goes this i went through this um my mom told me years after years after years, stop being a follower, stop being a follower, stop being a follower, basically stop being influenced by people who are not good, who are not in the right path. She wanted me to do the opposite. And I always made it my best to listen to her and to not be a follower. But of course, there's people I wanted to hang out with, there's people that I wanted to be like. And so I did what they did just because I thought it was cool, which wasn't cool. You feel me? We got 13 year olds trying to do drill. Is that really you? Or is that you trying to follow that pe person that actually is about that because you think it's cool? Which one is it? Because I'm confused. A lot of people do not know how serious influence is. Even influencers, even celebrities think they're not influencers, but technically they are because young people look up to y'all. Young people want to be like y'all. Young people want that lifestyle. So whatever they think, whatever they see y'all do, they're going to follow too. And I want to I want to bring to light that influence is real because a lot of these kids, a lot of these teenagers are going into the wrong path because they're thinking whatever that other person is just doing is the right thing because they get into the bag. But they don't know that person is doing bad stuff to get to that bag. And one day they're going to be locked the fuck up. And what they're going to be doing, crying to their people that they thought was going to be there for them, but it's not there for them. You feel what I'm saying? Like... I can't stress enough that how important it is to be yourself and to follow your own path and follow your own morals. Follow what your parents taught you. Don't try to be like nobody else. All that toughness, all that trying to be hood, trying to be someone you're not is going to get you in big trouble. And what you going to do, you're going to be by yourself. Nobody going to be there for you. Nobody going to be there. This, shit, this really touched my heart because... Like, there's so many times that I've seen people that's influenced, easily easily influenced, and I really feel some type of way. I feel like I got to jump in. And it don't even be about me. But I know what could happen if that person follows the bad person, so I got to jump in, even if I know them or not. Because I just care. I don't know. I just be caring about people, and it's just like, it really hurts that people are so easily influenced. But I'm not going to lie. I was one of them one day. I was one of them one day. In high school, in college, even in college, it took me a lot to really 
follow my own path to do what I got to do to do what I have to do to get where I want to be. Because influence is everywhere. You could be influenced at 30. You could be influenced at 50. You can be influenced at 10. You can be influenced. Influence is real. And a lot of you need to know what who is good to follow and who is not good. Do not be easily influenced. I'm telling you, that'll be the last time. That'll be one of the last things you do. You do if you are influenced because I'm not going to really like pinpoint anything, you know, specifically because I'm just being, I'm just being general because you can be influenced to go so, do somebody's hair and then you can be influenced to grab somebody's. Feel me? You can be influenced in any way, but all I'm saying is I need y'all to really know the difference between good, good influence and bad influence because influence is real. And I really want people to follow their follow their morals. Do not switch up because you see that that person is in that certain situation or that person is around that certain person or that person got that certain thing because they have to do a lot to get there. They have to do something that probably they regret to get there. And you don't even know the back of the hand. You don't even know the backstory. You're just following what you look. You're just looking at the cover. You're not looking through. I judge people so much and then when I really got to know them, I'm just like, damn. They probably feel the way I feel. They probably go through the same things I go through. But I see their cover and I just think, oh, they're living the life that I want to live. And that's why I realize I'm not in competition for nobody. I'm going my own path. I'm going to get my goals eventually. I'm going to follow my goals eventually. I'm going to get to where I want to be eventually on my own terms. Because I don't need to follow nobody to be in nobody's place. I'm going to have my own place ready for me to stand in that position when it's time. And that's plain and simple. I wanted to come on this, in this video right here to just tell you that influence is real and i'm gonna need you to start looking see who your real friends are do not follow that person that you think is an independent predicament or is looked at or a, one of the boys you like likes them so you're doing what they do because you want them to like you too i've been there done that you ain't gonna hit you nowhere follow yourself follow your path i'm pretty sure that guy is gonna look at you two years later and be like damn i wish i would have talked to her huh, i've been there i've been there and what you gonna say you gonna say, I was gonna say something else, but you gonna say whatever you whatever you wanna say. If you wanna be nice and give them a chance, go ahead. If you wanna be mean and don't give them a chance because they didn't give you a chance, go ahead. Because that's how I be feeling. Sometimes I'll be giving people chances, but sometimes I don't because would you have given me a chance? Really, let's talk about it. Would you have given me a chance? No, you wouldn't have. So why now? Why now? Influence is real, it's, it could be in anything, a song, a person. Social media, social media is a big influence. This is an influence. But I wanted to come on my, my platform and teach y'all what the right things to do instead of the wrong things. Because I don't want to be applauded for no wrong things. I don't want to be applauded for t t telling somebody to go out there and smoke more around it. Even though I smoke more around it. You don't see me exposing that. Okay, I just did. But don't go out there smoking because I'm telling you that is bad for you. It's going to be, you're never going to, it's going to be hard for you to stop. You, you, you're, first of all, your eating habits is going to be crazy. Like, you're not going to want to eat anymore. And then you're going to be lazy. Trust me, I've been there, done that. Don't smoke. If you don't, if you don't smoke already, don't start just because you see somebody else doing it. Just because you see somebody is cool. Just because you see it's in somebody's song that you like that, you know, that's your favorite celebrity and you see that they smoke and you want to smoke. Don't do it. Influence is real. It's in everything. It's in everyone. It's in all around. Positive and negative, but you got to know to follow the positive. So I just want to come over there and say that sweet little thing. Sweet little, you know, motivational girl talk, you know, for the boys and the girls because I know I got some boys on here too. Influence is real. Stick to who you are. That person that you want to notice you is gonna see you soon. That that goal you're gonna you trying to make is you're gonna reach your to your own way. Your own way. I don't need a scam. I get everything I want just by working hard. I don't need a scam. I don't, I don't need to do none of that fast money. I'm Gucci. You know who I ask? God, my brothers, and my mother. That's who I ask. Not a friend. Not a not a family member, not none of that. And if I ask a friend, I ask only my best friend. And that's only if I really, really need it. I'm an Aries. I stand on my own. I'm independent. My mom raised me. She makes me very goddamn well, too. I don't follow nobody path. You see somebody that got a car? You know how much young people that got a car and I don't got a car? You don't think, I, I, you don't think how I feel? You don't think I think I'm slacking? You don't think I think that? Yes, I think all of that. But my path, my journey is my way. I did things my way, and eventually I got everything I desired. Not everything, but most of the things. And if I didn't get that, that, that if I didn't get that yet, I'm gonna get it soon. 
So I just wanted to come on here, come on here quickly just to say that influence is real. And I need you to open your eyes. I need you to open those eyes, my my young, beautiful black queens and black princesses and black kings and and sons and, and mothers and whoever just watching me. I need y'all to open your eyes and see what's good influence and what's bad influence. Because all this other stuff that people be exposing on social media ain't what y'all need to be paying attention to. Y'all need to pay, pay attention to what y'all really like to do. Stay active. Find a goal. Invest. Okay. Half of y'all, y'all don't need to do that yet. Y'all too young. But definitely find a goal that you want to achieve, even if you are young. If that's trying to draw, if that's trying to dance, if that's trying to get into a nice, like, you know, learning how to get your own style. Definitely pay attention to something. You might make that into something. You might make it into a business. I wish I would have kept going through uh, through high school, kept going to the city, city to do dances at Broadway Dance Center. I would have probably been dancing at Broadway by now, but you know me, I was influenced. I was too busy trying to go to BBE parties. Influenced! Influence is real. You need to pay attention and open your eyes because a lot of the people that you're trying to be like ain't going to be nothing in three, four years. Ain't gonna be nothing. And you'll be like, damn. I'm over here trying to be like you because you was getting all the all the biddies and little hoes. And look at you now, working at McDonald's still. And you're 24. You see, things like that. <laughs> it, it ain't bad to work at McDonald's at 24. It ain't bad. Because best believe I did it. But I did that and something else. I'm just like, I, I, I just, I love income. I love having my own. I don't like asking nobody, not even my mother. I love having my own. Once I started, once I started having a job, I get sad when I don't have one. Even though my LaGuardia is killing my ass right now, I'm not going to lie. LaGuardia killing me right now. God, I want to quit. I want to quit so bad, and I just want to focus on YouTube. But like YouTube is just my hobby right now until I get up there. So we are gonna just keep going. We're gonna keep fighting. We're gonna keep reaching our goals, and we're gonna watch out for influence. We're gonna watch out for influence. Please don't let that. Please don't let that overcome, and then you end up in situations where you're like, damn. If I would have just went that way, if I would have just looked that way, if I would have just followed that other path, I would have been in a different situation, different predicament. Please don't, because there's a lot of things I regret in my life right now because I was easily influenced. I'm not going to hold you, but it's okay because I lived a damn good life. <laughs> I've been places, I've seen things, and I know what's right from wrong. I know who to trust, who not to trust, and I'm living my life to the best of my abilities. So I'm going to need y'all to stop being influenced. And if you are going to be influenced, be influenced by positive things, good people, people who want to be somebody. I want to be somebody. If y'all want to be influenced by somebody, be influenced by me. Everything I promote on my YouTube, I try to make it as positive, as fun, as, you know, as similarities to where y'all, like, I want y'all to understand. I want y'all to feel where I'm coming from. I want y'all to be on the same level. I ain't going to give this facade. I work for everything I got. I ain't scam. I ain't have no rich mama. My mom worked for everything that she got. I'm just spoiled her only daughter. She gave me everything I want because she loved me dearly. And we ain't rich over here. So you don't see all the glam and think otherwise and say you want to be like Lana. Because Lana, if you want to be like Lana, you want to be a hardworking black girl. That's what you want to be. Or hardworking black boy. That's what you're going to be. And that's what you, and that's when you're going to prioritize and put your money in the right situations to make something out of it i'm still trying to prioritize i'm still right now my main focus is saving 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 i come up with a budget for a reason i don't know what i want to do with my money yet but i just know one step at a time you know i don't know everything i don't know everything but i'm only giving for what i learned and what what i've grown from and matured from and the lessons i've learned i just want to bring it out bring it to y'all and i want y'all to see the real the real because social media will give you that facade and then you end up doing things to get to that to get to that certain platform and realize it ain't really what it seems. So don't get caught up in the social media lifestyle. Things is hard out here. We live in America, United States of America it ain't easy. It ain't easy. But make it make but make sure you make it your best life you ever lived. Just by being you, just by following your own path. Because people are gonna love you regardless. Maybe not. Maybe you won't be the person that you want to love you, but somebody out there gonna love you. Trust and believe. So I just want to say, like, comment, and subscribe. Influence is real. I hope I wasn't all over the place because I tech I tend to do that, get all over the place. But y'all know the moral of the whole thing about this video. 
Influence is real. Pay attention to it. It's there. It will haunt you if you decide to pick the wrong decision. That decision will haunt you for the rest of your life. Depending on what influence you go after. Because there can be some really, really bad influence. Some okay influence. And then some really, really good and some really, really good. You know, it depends. But influence is real. Good and bad. Just follow. try to follow the good. Please. We need some doctors and lawyers. And, 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 um... Plane drivers and train drivers and all that. We need some good people. We need people that want to work. We don't need all the extra scammers and the drug dealers. We don't need that. Stay away from that. I'm telling you that. Well, I mean, you know, I ain't going to tell nobody how to live their life, but I'm telling you, just go out there and get a knife. If I ain't that hard. Stop being lazy. Get your ass up. We trying, to, we, got, we trying to go up, right? We trying to go up, right? So, up, okay? So remember to like, comment, and subscribe. This was a little girl talk, boy talk, whoever whoever just wanted to watch me. Whoever just wanted to watch me talk my S-H-I-T. Anyways, remember to like, comment, and subscribe. I don't want to chit-chat because I could go into other situations that will probably be for another video. But see you in the next video. Bye.